for a concert, you know, but I had a blast. Yeah. And what what I'd realized was that after the show, on my way home, and when I when I got home, I got all these emails from students, uh, just telling me about life and yeah. telling me about the the struggles that they are going through, right. telling me about their lives individually and, and some of the things that have taken place. And I realized that there was um, a lot more hurt out there than I'd ever realized yeah. in the first place. And um, really, I just, uh, it was one of those things where after I played that first school, I think the next school in town kind of heard about right. it. And they and so wanted just to bring me snowballed. in. Yeah, and so now, it's like all I do. Yeah. I mean, the, my main thing is um, the Blue Project is playing. Uh, like I said, I started out in high schools, and I remember the first time I got asked to play in middle school. It was actually right. where I went to school. It was Vestal Middle School, and I was terrified. I was like, "Man, I don't know how to play for middle school kids. Man, they're going to eat me alive." But I actually have a ton yeah. of fun with uh, with uh, playing for middle schools. Yeah. My wife is a middle school teacher too, so um, and uh, it's really, really snowballed. Yeah. And and I bring all that back because you know, if all of these years, if I had been a Christian artist. I would never be able to go into these right. schools. My the Blue Project, um, you know, there's a very, very strong line there. When I go into public schools, I'm not able to say anything right. about my faith, right. which I respect because I understand that I'm there to do a, a job and right. <clears throat> and have a focus. So my my faith, um, a lot of schools always ask, like, are you going to come in and talk about Jesus? Right. And the thing is, is I understand that um, there is a line there. Right. You know, unfortunately, there's a line there. Right. You know, what these kids need most, I can't give them right. when I'm on that stage. Um, but uh, if I had been a Christian artist all these years, I would never. You never got out to the I would schools, never yeah. be able to be in these schools, and um, so the Blue Project has really snowballed into this program that's um, geared around real life um, pertaining to right. students. Um, basically, it's a concert, and I take students through all these songs that I wrote, and every song kind of has a different topic or okay. a different issue. And um, you know, I talk about I talk about um, finding the good in life when you're in the midst of bad right. circumstances, overcoming obstacles, okay. and um, you know, these days it's so hard to go into a school and not be affected by the bullying issue. Right. That's and a so a lot thing. of my program has to do with that. I wrote a song for a girl um, who was bullied horribly in school. Um, in fact, uh, she wrote me a message. It was the month of January, and it was a it was a winter day, you know. But it was a beautiful day. Yeah. It was blue sky, and I'm in my kitchen reading these messages from students. And this girl writes me a message, and she says, "Jared, you came to my school, and um, you know, you you played these songs." And uh, she said, "I wasn't there the day that you came." Yeah. Um, but she begins to tell me her story. And the reason why she wasn't there that day was because she was in the hospital with depression because of the way she gets treated yeah. in schools, and. Uh, I wrote this song for her because as I read her message, it began to snow uncontrollably yeah. outside. And I wrote a song for her, um, really based around her life and her experience with being bullied. And I relate that to students about, That's great. here's a real life yeah. um, thing. So I could play a little bit of that yeah, song for you, you yeah. and we'll keep okay. rolling. And, yeah. okay. um, so this is probably the one of the most requested songs of the program. This is a song called January Snow and it goes like this. They put me away in a place to try to make me feel better To take the trials I face And make them go away But as long as these people keep calling me names I don't think that these problems will ever change No, not today well, Not today well, Tears are falling like January snow And nobody seems to know that I've been feeling this pain and fighting this fight Seems the day that I was born Yeah, and sticks and stones may break my bones But your words hurt more than you'll ever know Making all my tears fall to the ground Just like a January snow Sometimes I just break from the pain of when this heart of mine gets shattered Yeah, the smile of fake seems to fade away When I'm left alone to cry Oh, to think of the ways that I'm beaten down Yes, and broken up, oh, and pushed around I need someone to save me I need someone, yeah When tears are falling like January snow And nobody seems to know 
That I've been feeling this pain and fighting this fight Seems the day that I was born Yeah, and sticks and stones may break my bones But your words hurt more than you'll ever know Making all my tears fall to the ground Just like a January snow so that's about it. You know, it's her story yeah. and a song that I wrote, and uh, it's been cool to relate that to students. So, um, you know, that's kind of what the program's about. No, that's great because yeah. bullying is such a big yeah. thing going yeah, on it's now. Huge. And it's uh, huge. I love the way you uh, put it with the snow and everything. Yeah. A lot of great feeling. So. Yeah, cool. Uh, I guess one of the things I want to kind of talk to you about on uh, Sunday, January 10th, you're coming to Endwell United Methodist Church. And yeah. You're, are going to be doing a free concert outside on the lawn. We're hoping that yeah. the weather's going to be decent. <laughs> yeah, praying, uh, praying for some sunshine. Uh, and if it doesn't, we'll be inside in the mm -hmm. sanctuary. But we are uh, uh, looking forward. And it's something that the church, Edwell United Methodist, is sponsoring. Uh, it's for our neighbors to show our gratitude for everything mm -hmm. and kind of also helping the whole community to pull together. Definitely. I mean, we've gone through. Our whole community's gone through a lot in the last year, and yeah. this is our way of giving back to everybody by having this uh, concert and having you there and giving your message out, which I think is very important. Definitely. Uh, we're also gonna tie in uh, kind of a, Pentecost is this coming Sunday, but we kind of postponed it, and we're going to have our Pentecost celebration also on that Sunday. Mm -hmm. uh, we're going to be celebrating uh, our high school graduates that day, mm -hmm. uh, our young people who are our compromands. Uh, also, we're going to be dedicating a brand new uh, chicken barbecue pit. Uh, yeah. We built, and I know you saw Exciting. a nice <laughs> uh, covered barbecue pit that um, is was built in honor of one of our members, Larry Vesley, who his mm -hmm. uh, always had said you know he'd love to do that at church and we finally said okay it's something we'd like to try to do and he was also a fire commissioner for the fire department and the fire department in Endwell graciously gave us the cinder blocks and the grates oh, that's we awesome. built the building and uh, we're going to have our first chicken barbecue that right. night so that's going to start at 5 30 we'll have hamburgers or hot dogs and sausage and peppers yep uh, and then the concerts at 6 30 we invite everyone to yeah. come that night uh, and enjoy. Anybody in town. Yeah. Get <coughs> it's going to be a great night. And, yeah. Uh, now, I think you said you might bring a couple other people. With I'm going to try. Yeah, I'm going to try to grab a couple of my friends uh, yeah. who are musicians. And okay. We'll, we're going to jam. It's going to be fun. Good. You know, uh, it's, uh, we're going to be looking forward. It's going to be yeah, a great night. Uh, definitely. So maybe if you could give us one more song. Yeah, sure. Okay. Um, we'll do uh, we'll do a fun little. This is one of the little songs off the CD too. So okay. we're gonna have a lot of fun on, on the 10th. Yeah. And um, this song's been cool. It's a song I wrote, which is also on the Amazing Grace CD. Yeah. A song called Knocking Me Over. Okay, so, before you start. Yeah. Now, if people wanna buy your albums, yep. where do they? Uh... Well, if they wanna buy my stuff, um, of course, come to the show on the okay. 10th. I'll have my CDs there available. Okay. Um, I believe some of the CDs might still be available at Barnes & Noble and Vestal. Okay. So if you want to sneak in there. And then online, you know, everything's online these right. days. So if you go to jaredcampbell.com, there's a little store tab. Okay. And you can download all of my songs right there. Or my songs are all on okay. iTunes right. as well. Okay. So, Great. Um, yeah. So this is uh, another tune here. Okay. And I'll play a little bit of it for you. It goes like this. Okay. Your love is real, like a wind coming in, knock me off my feet again. Yeah, it come knock me over with your love. And this love I feel, like the force of a wave when the tide is rolling in, yeah. Mm, you come knock me over with your love and you feel me when I encounter. I love your wonder. Oh, you come knock me over with your love and you move me in your power. I can't stand no longer. Oh, you come knock me over, knock me over, yeah. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Your love is wide. And it comes at me like a force on every side Yeah, you come knocking me over with your love and 
Your love is deep and it's rising to the surface from beneath, yeah You come knocking me over with your love and you feel me When I encounter all of your wonder Oh, you come knocking me over with your love and you move me in your power I can't stand no longer Oh, you come knocking me over with your love Saying how high, how deep, how wide From oceans to the sky Your love continues for ever and ever When I think I'm reached the heights You catch me by surprise And you come in, you come knocking me over And you feel me when I encounter all of your wonder Oh, you come knocking me over with your love And you move me in your power I can't stand no longer Oh, you come knocking me over, knocking me over, yeah Oh, yeah, 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 yeah You come knocking me over With your love, with your love There you go. Very good. Yeah. Again, uh, on uh, Sunday, June mm -hmm. 10th at 6.30 in the evening, yep. uh, Jared's going to be doing a free outdoor concert at Endwell United Methodist Church. We're located at 3301 Watson Boulevard in Endwell. Mm -hmm. uh, if you're hungry, you can come at 5.30. We're going to have a chicken barbecue. So 5.30 is the chicken barbecue right. and then, until uh, we'll, it's gone. Until it's gone. Then we'll have uh, also have some hot dogs or sausage and peppers for okay. sale. Um, and of course, your free concert, and yeah. we're really looking forward to yeah, it. Yeah, it'll be great. So. It's uh, it definitely, you know, something to bring the family out to. Right. Some, I think a lot of times when there's events and different things, it's hard to know whether or not it's family friendly or right. whatever. But man, bring the kids, bring the aunts yeah. and the uncles and the cousins, bring everybody, yeah. you know. And so. it's open to all ages. It's yeah. just not young people. Exactly. We, we would like everybody to come exactly. and enjoy yeah. the evening. It's, it's going to be fun. It's yeah. going to be cool. And uh, we're going to pray for some sunshine and some nice weather, right. and uh, it'll be good. <laughs> we yeah. are. So we'll as long see. as it's not the hot weather that we had before. Exactly, but yeah. Decent weather. Yeah. Really awesome. looking forward to it. Definitely. It'll and be I appreciate it so much that you took the time. I know you, you're very busy. You said you're going <laughs> yep. out of state next week. So yeah, i got to head to North Carolina next week for a show. Yeah. And, um, yeah, I'm always bouncing yeah, around, so. but uh, I'm just glad I got enough sleep yeah. to make it here today <laughs> and uh, well, and to pull it off without okay. yawning yeah. too much. Well, so. I appreciate your taking the time Definitely. to uh, be here and share your music with us. Cool. It was great. Thank yeah. you so much. So once again, you know, if anybody wants to know, jaredcampbell.com is my okay. website. And then for the Blue Project, the website for that is jc, like my initials, jcblueproject.com. Okay. So great. You can find all that stuff there. So check it out, and uh, we'll see you on June 10th. Very good. Yeah. Okay. Thank awesome. you again, you and uh, thank you for uh, watching Encounter, sponsored by the Broome County Council of Churches. <laughs>